Welcome to the Ghost Key. I am Gray. Today we're doing some more of this tower thing, I guess, right? And we're gonna piss off this old guy and probably get his phone number and all that good shit. Blah 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 blah. By the way, like this weekend or week or whatever, it was a week. Whatever it was, stupid fucking cat making all this goddamn noise back here. Um, they they announced the whole Pokémon Fighters thing and all that good shit. So people are excited about that. I'm interested to see how that works out. Mostly because I, I I've, I've played Tekken a lot over the years, and to see something kind of like that with Pokémon would be interesting. I'm not super up in it because like how's 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 fucking wheezing and coughing gonna fight shit? Like, think about that. Like, how awkward that'd be. A big purple ball just floating around, puffing gas and shit. I don't know. And yeah, I, it, it isn't... Eh. It's one of those things that could go well, or it could just be not very well thought out. And I have a feeling it's going to be one of those things that's not very well thought out. But, you know, it is what it is. You can't really, you can't really get too pissed off about it if that's, if that's your thing. So, everybody's going to have fun with it, I guess. But we'll see. We'll see how it works out. I probably won't even fucking get it, honestly. I, I'm so like removed from everything that's current in gaming right now that it's, you know. Oh, you son of a bitch! This guy's a dick. But anyway, I'm so removed from that sort of shit right now that it's it's not even funny. I mean, the the only thing like that I like keep up on. I wouldn't even say I keep up on it. But the only thing that I really that I really pay attention to is, um, I'm gonna set up a fucking smoke screen and see if that works here. The only thing I really pay attention to is, like, the Borderlands DLC and shit like that. And that's only because I get that shit straight to my phone. <laughs> I mean, quite honestly, that's the only stuff I really care about. So it's like, oh, look at that. New Borderlands shit. And then I go in into the codes and I don't play it. Like, quite honestly, that's what I do. I'm like, oh, yeah, let's put that code in and get that shit. And then, ooh, shit, get out of here, bro. You go, Phyllis. You go. That's what I'm talking about. Look at you, Phyllis. Look at you, Phyllis. Self-destruct. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep old moves. <laughs> I'm not into that shit. Although it's kind of funny, like, when I play Magic the Gathering and all that shit, yeah, I, I play that shit too. I'm gonna switch into Pele here before I, before I get too crazy. Um... When I, when I play Magic, I, I usually make like suicidal decks and shit like that, but when it comes to Pokemon, I'm not really into that. I'm, I'm, I'm a little pansy when it comes to that shit. I'm like, no, don't die. Especially like, obviously, if you're playing Nuzlocke, and that's one of the reasons why I don't like Nuzlocke. I mean, it kind of takes out some of the game. I mean, I don't know, like a lot of people like him. I'm just not really into that shit as much. I mean, we'll definitely do them just for the added challenge, but I don't as I've said before, I don't, I don't feel like it really has, a, it feels out of place, that's what it is, and I don't like it when things feel out of place, at least to me, the whole idea of the Nuzlocke and everything feels out of place, and I don't like that, I just, I don't know why, I don't like things like that, I'm gonna keep old moves, because defense curl, like why would you learn defense curl at level 24, that doesn't make a lot of sense, although it probably would be useful now that I think about it, considering it's Pele, and all it's gonna have is fire type moves I believe, and oh god damn, oh yeah, never mind. I, I, I see the door, it's like oh shit, what are we gonna do, and then I'm like oh wait, door, found it, found it, but anyhow, um, this week I, I did kind of kind of come up with a nice little nifty idea for a uh, like a Pokemon tabletop uh, thing um, so kind of trying to work out how it would work but it used the the trading card game as the battle system which would be interesting the only problem is I just need players to try it out but you know uh, it's still some pretty cool shit you know going on in my little noggin Damn, that stomp fucked his shit up. Do it again. Use those little spider legs. Cray cray, goddamn. Cray cray. Cray cray cray. Cray 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 cray. Cray cray. I love cray cray. So far, definitely one of my favorite uh, Pokemon ever used in, in, in a playthrough. 
And that includes whenever I've played it on my own, not just an LP, as some people usually say, you know. Whoop! How did we just fall out of the sky to that spot? Anyone want to wrap their minds around that? How did that happen? Did we just like walk out of, of the fucking tower down there and just fall? This little purple ball behind us. See how the But anyhow. Um, oh, this guy. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. We got no choice. Jasmine must be worried sick, bitch. She ain't worried about nothing. But anyhow, we do have a lot of a lot of stuff coming up here. Um, uh, in terms of just a lot of episodes, it's gonna take quite a bit, I think, to um, to to get out of here and then move on through uh, the fucking route that we gotta surf through. Which, if you've ever surfed through a route in Pokemon, you know you're gonna have a fucking tentacle up your ass every two seconds. And not to mention little swimmers who are like, oh, 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 fight my star you, and then you're like, bitch, get out of here. And then a Wingull, you know, swoops down and takes your Bulbasaur away, shit like that. Yeah, see, that's, mm -hmm. that's what we have to look forward to. That actually is probably going to be like two, three episodes, just because it's so goddamn annoying. But, but, on the flip side... We will get fly, although we have nothing that can learn fly. Although I do think they need to make Scyther learn fly, but you know, um, I'm not programming nor am I balancing this shit for obvious reasons because Scyther would get a lot of love. That's what Krabby, goddamn Krabby. Love the Cray Cray. I can't manage to smile either. Shut your bitch ass. Anyway, um, man, yeah. Take, take, take the wall with you, not, not the little Pokeball. Do you ever think it was kind of weird that like everything in this game is sitting around in a little Pokeball? I always thought it was a little weird. I was like, oh, item and a Pokeball. But anyway, back to my idea for a tabletop game. It would be great because you could run, you know, whatever system you want to run, a D20 or 3D6, whatever the hell you like running, you know, and then create your own little world and storyline and all that wonderful shit. This is gonna hurt. Oh, that wasn't so bad. Fuck you, smog and missing and shit. But anyway, you know, I'm gonna go with Cray Cray. Because we're gonna need the Cray Crays here. But, um, you, you, could, you could do all that sort of shit. And then, you know, your battle system, use the card game. And, and use the cards themselves. Actual cards. Think about this. As the loot for the game. Same thing, obviously, with Pokemon that you encounter that you can have your players catch or whatever, you know. Now you're thinking, hey, this is going to be a solo fight. Not necessarily, or a solo RPG or whatever you want to call it. You know, we're going to keep battling for this Fear I'm not really scared of Fear with Cray Cray out there. But, but it could be, it could be interesting if you had multiple players. Obviously, then you could have double battles and shit like that using the cards and the card game, so on and so forth. Which would be interesting. Wouldn't be too hard to bend some of the rules and shit like that and change how the game is is, is kind of designed just to accommodate those sorts of things. But it could be fun. I think it could be fun. But, you know. I, I'm, you know I'm just... I don't know. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. All I do know is that Spiro just got the shit stomped out of it. I mean, goddamn Cray Cray. Stomping all over bitches. Stomping all over bitches. I should, I really should be leveling up the other ones. I really still need to go and do that, in all honesty. Um, I think this is the top, right? No, there's still more. Holy Jesus. All right, we are gonna have to heal some bitches though, because, because we can. That's pretty much the only reason reasoning I have for that there. Because we're not going to use Pele for this fight, but Phyllis, perhaps, and the same with the Wreckage. I really do need Wreckage getting some levels here. Because like I said, Wreckage will be that second sweeper and, and, you know, give us something else, in theory, to, to go in and fuck shit up with. I knew, and do need more stall moves on um, Cray Cray, in all honesty. Um, kind of look at that, actually. Because obviously it's going to have like shit like Crab Hammer later when it finally gets it. Uh, 
Polyworld, 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 Polyworld. Can you, can you smog it? Can you actually do something here? I hate smog's accuracy. Smog's accuracy is shit. It's like, seriously, you can't fucking hit. Smog is like everywhere. Oh my god. And he's just gonna keep rain dancing, which is fine. I'll just throw wreckage out there and let wreckage go nuts. Because what else is wreckage? Yeah, fuck you and your hypnosis. By the way, this game, when I was leveling up, hypnosis, it says, is like, what, 50%, 60% accuracy or some dumb shit? It is not, dude. It is like 85, 90. That shit is ridiculous. See? Look at that. Ah, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, Polyworld. And it's always wreckage that gets it, too. Always wreckage. Every time. Every time. Fuck you, yeah. Get your bitch ass and double slap and shit out of here. I really wish I had sand attack or some shit. On, on, um, on Phyllis. That would be nice. Or even on Cray Cray, because I don't think, I don't think it ever comes with sand attack, I don't think. But, fuck you and your water gun and shit. Wake the fuck up, wreckage. Oh, shit's about to go down now. Too bad this is the only Pokemon he has. And that's if we ever wake the fuck up. But, you know, whatever. Just a fucking little spiral of oh, Fuck you. Get out of here, you bitch. You got a big ass target painted on your face, anyhow. That was way more painful than it should have been, right? Sailor Terrell. I'm glad I don't have to fight her up at the top. And that, that's one thing known to suck ass. Oh, hello. Hello, guy. I wanted to battle Jasmine, but she don't want to battle me, he says. What have you got? He brings out this guy. This little guy. <sighs> we're, we're, I'm going to give you a taste of what's to come here with fucking, what's his name, Chuck? Is that is that the guy? Is, is that the guy we got? The next gym leader, Chuck, our fifth. Is that your fifth? And then Jasmine's our sixth. Yeah, then I think we only got two more. They kind of give you a bunch of gems really early in this game, and then they kind of leave you hanging for a while. So you gotta go and do that Red Gyarados thing, and then you, you finally do the Team Rocket thing up there, and then you finally get another gym badge, I think. And then you finally go and get the last one, and then and then you gotta come back and do the. Um, I'm gonna go with fucking Hellas over here, and then you gotta go do the. Other Team Rocket thing in Goldenrod, I think. I think that's the order of all that shit. And then you go back and take out the last gem, if I remember right. I could be wrong. Could be wrong. Not sure, fuck. You know, I really don't have much here. I'm just gonna have to go. Water absorb! Oh, fuck you, says Halas. I'm gonna surf all over your bitch ass. And damn, I did a lot more than I thought it would. Let's see how your ice shark does right here. Oh, oh come on. Can we, can we get him? Can we get him? Oh, that was horse shit. Oh, and I was gonna get stuck in this double slap loop for like 10 days. Oh, thank god, only two times. Fine, we'll just surf you again. We'll just surf all out. Never mind. Oh, we'll just get, get, get to this. Keep on going. There you go. Now you're done. Thank god. Anyhow. I have no idea what I'm gonna talk about. This episode is running long, but I don't want to stop it because I know this is like the last guy, the last guy before before uh, fucking we get to Jasmine. She's like, oh my god, the Lapras is sick. Go save it. And you're like, fine, I will. Then you go do that, and then it's like, god damn it. And you're like, hey, I got fly now. I can fly back there. And then you're like, no, I don't have a flying type. Son of a bitch. Actually, we do have that fucking bird in there, Kenya. I am going to teach that fucker fly. I'm like, oh, we're out. <laughs> yes. Oh, I don't want to go up there just yet. I want to grab you, a super repel. Yeah, those don't work as well as I hoped they would. Mm mm. Nope, any nope, nope. Yep. 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 Open the dough, ho. Oh. 
Oh, is, is that it? She doesn't say it. Go on this grant. Okay, there we go. Alright. Just making sure, you know. We, 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 we see that. Oh my god. A super podion. Wonderful! But anyhow. Now we're gonna get on out of here. And then, oh. Look at, look at that. Look at that. Look at Phyllis. Look at Phyllis all happy. Ah, I smell like shit. Oh, happy. Anyhow, now we've got the whole little questy thingy storyline shit to go out to whatever the hell that place is and get the super secret medicine or whatever the fuck it is. I, I don't really know. I really have no idea. I, I just do what they tell me to do and then forget about it in like 10 minutes. But anyhow. Um. Yeah, so that about does it for this episode. If you've made it this far on YouTube, thanks a lot for watching, and remember, the ghost key is the only place where pants are optional. <laughs>